Since the S24 Plus may get significant display updates, the forthcoming Galaxy S24 Ultra may use the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 globally. Samsung stunned Galaxy S fans earlier this year by ditching its two-chipset approach for the Galaxy S23 series and instead powering the flagship trio with a Qualcomm chip globally. Exynos was briefly out of the picture. The Exynos chip is said to be returning to the Galaxy S series next year, but things will be different. According to a recent report, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 for Galaxy chipset would power the Galaxy S24 Ultra exclusively globally. That will not be the case for the remainder of the 2024 range, but the Ultra model will apparently be an exception. According to Angia Market Statistics, the Galaxy S23 Ultra will compete with Samsung's best-selling flagship in the first half of 2023. In fact, it was the best-selling Android phone globally, and some suspect that the Snapdragon exclusivity was one of the reasons for this success. However, while the base and plus models benefited equally from this ship exclusivity, they failed to make the top 10 list, as fans seemed to gravitate more toward the Ultra model. Regardless, by employing a Snapdragon chip only for the 2023 flagship phones, Samsung may have painted itself into a corner. Many fans favor Snapdragon over Exynos, thus it may be difficult for Samsung to revert to its original two-pronged approach of dividing the market between Exynos and Snapdragon CPUs throughout the whole flagship series. The Galaxy S24 and S24 Plus are expected to feature the unreleased Exynos 2400 soak in certain areas, as well as the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 and others. In order to please fans, the Galaxy S24 Ultra will use the Snapdragon chip worldwide. In terms of the chips themselves, the Exynos 2400 chip seems promising on paper, particularly given that Samsung had much more time to create it, it is believed to feature 10 CPU cores and twice as many GPU cores as the Exynos 2200. The Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 Samsung Galaxy includes 8 CPU cores, with some of them running faster than the normal version of the chip. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So with that been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.